Health care options in DeKalb County are expanding. The hospital held an open house this afternoon to show off its new North Campus. News Channel 15 Sarah Wagner got a tour. She joins us now with more. It was a packed house at DeKalb Health today. It's clear the community is very excited about the improvements and the new level of convenience it brings to the area. Construction on the 30,000 square foot facility started last May. Almost a year later, DeKalb Health cuts the ribbon on the $6.7 million project. This will provide kind of a one-stop shop for the community to be able to get more services. The hospital says it's ready to serve the community in a much larger way. Having them here will help people in the community because they won't have to go out of the community to get something. The new space holds offices, exam rooms, and treatment areas. DeKalb Health says it will become the new hub for services that often go together like orthopedics and rehabilitation. It's a service that's been long. Part of the nearly $7 million expansion here at DeKalb is this pediatric gym. The goal is for families to learn therapies here that they can then use at home. We have good therapists and now they have a place to work. The project also expanded DeKalb Business Health's offices. We do the industrial things for the county, basically. From pre-employment drug screening to workplace injuries, the office stays very busy and says the expansion will help businesses across the county. So the people that come in, we can get them in, get them out, get them back to work quicker. Fort Wayne Orthopedics is another part of the renovations. The office is at least two or three times the size of our last office. That office went from six exam rooms. If you put two or three providers in there, it's very difficult. To 15. The rooms are bigger, waiting rooms bigger. The ease of in and out is much better than the last space. So this is a huge expansion for us. An expansion the hospital says provides another way to maintain its independence. The community built this place and we'd like to keep it that way. The expansions aren't over either. The hospital is also working on renovating the second and third floors. That project is expected to be done by late June. Sarah Wagner, News Channel 15.